I'm just walking through the local park here in Idlib City, the main park in Idlib City. Uh, SubhanAllah, it's, uh, it's, it's filled with electricity now. I know it might seem like a simple concept in many parts of the world, but in war-torn Idlib, it's a great achievement. It's definitely a big relief for the Syrian people to be able to see some light at night in the streets, in the public places, hospitals, parklands, streets. It's really an important feeling of normal life for those Syrian people, the refugees who have witnessed bombardment and destruction at the hands of the Assad regime, the Russians and the Iranians. I'm just going for a bit of a stroll, mashallah, the, the park's full. It's about 10 p.m. here in Idlib. Uh, you've got uh, some animals, some rides, uh, some little events that the, the local authorities and the people here have tried to provide for the Syrian people and the residents of the city. SubhanAllah, it's important, it's an important step, an important stage in the revolution to show that the liberated areas and the revolution are capable of providing services for the Syrian people, the hurt refugees. Uh, electricity is definitely a very important aspect in life and necessity which will provide job opportunities, work, an uh, important aspect for success in the liberated areas and managing and governing the life of the Syrian people. It's your brother Ibrahim from Idlib, Syria, here in the park, in the middle of the city. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.